If you are waiting for Samsung's latest mid-range phone, the Galaxy A55, then I've got this for you. And review on the A55 and ice blue color was leaked before its launch, revealing its full design. This time, Samsung has gone for a premium design on the A55, featuring a metal frame and a glass housing. It looks almost identical to the S24, except for the chunkier bezels. The frame has a key island design, which means the device's power and volume buttons are raised above that frame. Inside the box you will have just the USB-C cable. And again the back glass is glossy, and it has Gorilla Glass Vectis plus protection on both the front and back. The display on this phone is way brighter than the last one, hitting 1615 nits. The A54 only had 1000 nits. The phone could also have the biggest vapor chamber ever for an A-series phone which means better cooling and better sustained performance. Interestingly, a benchmark reveals the A55 could have a variant with 12 GB of RAM which is kind of weird because the base S24 still comes with 8 GB RAM. So it's possible Samsung may not actually release this variant, at least not in every market. All the mid-range Galaxy phones so far stuck to 8GB RAM, right? But imagine if they do bring out a 12GB RAM mid-range phone. That would mean better user experience, better multitasking, smoother UI, reduced stutter, and more. Moving on, it will get an Exynos chip with an AMD GPU. On the software front, Samsung has confirmed that the phone will not get seven years of software updates like the S24 lineup. We're looking at four OS updates and five years of security updates, which totally makes sense. I mean, come on, seven years of updates for a mid-range phone. That's just overdoing it because, let's be real, the phone won't stick around that long. Also, it seems like the phone won't be getting the AI features that come with the S24. Although Samsung didn't mention it, but the absence of any AI hints in the A55 teasers is a dead giveaway. You know how Samsung loves to showcase the Galaxy AI experience on its latest flagship. Well, they'd probably be shouting about it for the A55 too if it had those AI features. Plus, the A55's Exynos chip might not pack enough punch to handle the advanced AI stuff seen in the S24 lineup. So, chances are, it might miss out on a lot of what makes One UI 6.1 special. So guys, there's nothing big new in Samsung A55. Same cameras as A54. Same display with a bit higher brightness. Same design. I don't think the A55 worth the upgrade this year. What you think guys? Let me know in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe the channel. I will catch you in the next video. Till then take care and bye.